Here's a quick look at the last Drake I'm putting on eBay. The only remaining Drake is this TR4C that I got from a guy in Florida who I'd bought a few Drakes from and I was still in the Drake collection mode. But now I'm sort of like in the summer mode, I don't know. Sell off some Drakes, so this one is also for sale. This This is a very unusual Drake in that the PTO gearing here has all been revised. It's really interesting. So it has the best PTO gearing I've ever seen in the uh, Drake C series, the 4C series. And anyway, this one came out okay. There's no blotches or anything on the front panel. I took the whole front panel off today and cleaned everything up. Cleaned up all the knobs. I, I couldn't get the knobs perfect, and I thought I had new knobs, but I don't have any new knobs anymore, so the knobs that are on this guy are here. This knob here is actually a metal knob. I think it's a knob probably from an R390 or some older radio. It's metal, and it's really good for the band switch. So I, this knob was over here. I moved it over here. And, yeah, this is, an, this is the latest, the last TR4C in the 31,000 serial number range that... Drake made. It's a pretty nice radio. So here I'll show you how it works. I'm on 40 meters right now. We've been getting lots of uh, weird noise at night on 40, kind of like this bad static. That's 40 meters. What about 80? Let's see if it's ending on 80 meters. Usually not until later. Well, what do you know? There's somebody there, but they aren't talking much. That's 80 meters. Let's try 20. I doubt 20 will have anybody on it, but there's 20, upper side band.
FT8. Okay, there's a uh, there's twenty. There are people on here. Anyway, that's this is 20 meters. It's not real strong. Let's try 15 now. Let's see if there's any FT8. Yep. So there is FT8. Now on these drakes, when the tubes warm up, the S meter needs to be adjusted a bit. So this one has finally warmed up. So what you do is you just basically detune the radio, some band, and uh, detune it. And then you want to use this knob here and center the S meter. So we'll do that now because the radio warmed up and this will creep around. So you kind of want to let it run for half an hour and then zero the S meter like that. There you go. Now it's zeroed. Now we're good to go. Back to 15 now. There's 15. And there's our FT8. So you can see 15 has some signal coming in. It's working pretty darn good. That's FT8. Let's try for some sideband. Nothing. There's the FT8. 10 meters, that won't be alive. These two slots here are missing crystal. That's missing a crystal. Missing a crystal has a crystal that's active. So the previous owner or somebody swiped him. Who knows? All right. 10 meters. I'm not expecting much on here. Not a thing. All right. Back to 40 meters. Forty meters right there. Uh, 
before in broadcast. Okay, and this radio has an issue with the calibrator. I didn't fix the calibrator. It works, but let's try it. There it is. Now it works. Okay, well, it's a little shaky. A little shaky, but it works. All right. Well, yeah. So the calibrator might need cleaned up a little bit. Maybe the crystal receded or the tube receded or something. I didn't go into that. So, yeah, I wasn't able to put my full fixing potential in this radio because the power supply got bought and the power supply has to go out tomorrow. So I really can't spend much more time on this radio. It's for sale the way it is, and I think it works pretty good myself. All right, that's my demo reception on the uh, new TR4C, the high serial number with the improved PTO. This thing is pretty nice. Give it a consideration, okay? It's my last Drake four line here. I'm uh, purging my four line because I'm probably going to have to move sometime again. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.